guys, what's up? Welcome back to our channel. If you guys are new around here, hey, hello and welcome. We're Splatterbox Art. Our goal is to bring fun painting lessons to you at home. And just like that, we're ready to get started. I'm so excited to, oh, oh my. <laughs> Careful with that one at home. You don't wanna get paint everywhere. Okay, now that we have our splatter, <laughs> you can start spreading that out and filling up your entire background. But I'm so excited to paint this balloon dog with you today, and we're gonna make it look like an electric neon sign that will light up the sky. Ready, set, go. And if you happen to have a hairdryer around, it'll really speed up this process. Or maybe you were smart and just started on a black piece of paper. Awesome, let's get started drawing. <laughs> Not quite sure what I was doing with that pencil, but anywho, let's start with our balloon dog. So we're gonna draw our balloon dog right in the middle of our paper. And we're first gonna start out with the snout. We're gonna bring it up a little, around and down, and almost connect it back together. Do you see how that becomes the snout? And this is where the balloon would tie off where our knot would be. So it almost looks like a little C. Then we're gonna come up around, almost like a very tall rainbow, and connect it back over. And one more line to complete the other ear. Now it's time for our neck. Two little lines just curved on either side and its body. This one should be easy. It's almost like a backward C. Now for our bottom legs, or our front legs rather, that's just a stretched out oval. And to connect the other one, we're almost there guys. We're gonna add on the back leg and then the one that's behind. And finally, our tail. It's gonna get that extra little tip at the end of its tail. That's where the balloon doesn't get fully blown up. I'm sure you've seen that before. Awesome job, guys. And don't forget, you can rewind, pause, practice on a separate piece of paper, whatever makes it easier. Guess what, guys? It's time to paint. Now that we got the hard part out of the way, getting the drawing done, this part's gonna be really relaxing. I'm gonna speed it up from here, but make sure you stick around. I have tons of fun facts about balloon dogs and neon signs. And be sure to subscribe, like, and hit that notification bell so you know when our videos go live. All right, here we go. Warp speed. All right, as you watch this neon sign come together, I have a few fun facts for you. So every time you see this button, I'll have something cool to tell you. I couldn't stay away for long. Here's fact number one. Do you know the name of the artist who created the balloon dog sculpture? His name is Jeff Koons. And Koons started making and selling art at eight years old. He sold his art in his father's antique shop. Before he was known to be one of the highest paid living artists of all time, he left his work selling stocks for First Investors Corporation. One of his most famous works is the one we're working on right now, his balloon dog sculpture. It sold for over $58 million in 2008 and it's standing tall in a brilliant magenta color at the Palace of Versailles. It's looking great, guys. Time for our outer hot pink glow and one last fact about Jeff Koons. Did you know that he's considered the king of kitsch? Which simply means poor taste. Go take a look at some of his sculptures and see what you think. Does he have poor taste? 
That's what's cool about art. Everyone can have their own opinions. All right, and here are a few quick ones about neon. Neon is a colorless and odorless gas and is used mostly to make neon signs. A sign maker even said that most neon signs live out their lifetime longer than the shop that actually had them. That's kind of sad in a way, don't you think? But let's have some fun. Let's start splattering. Make sure you're in a space where it's okay. <laughs> Wow guys, I had so much fun hanging out and painting with you today. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit that notification bell so you know when our videos go live. See you next time. Bye.